Hello, my name's Monique, and welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, welcome. If you're subscribed, welcome back. Um, I got a weekly wrap-up for you, a weekly vlog for y'all, what I've read and what I'm currently reading right now. Um, I read I read five books in a week. Uh, from March 1st uh, through March 8th, I read five books out of the seven. Um, let me show you what I've read. First book I finished. A, a Daughter of Smoke and Bone. This is the Lee Taylor's a Saga. This is book number one in it. Um, I did a book review on this, so it'll probably be up before... It'll probably be up after my... Um, after this vlog, uh, my weekly vlog. So, be the lookout for it. Um, but I gave it a five stars. It was fantastic. The next one I finished. Magnus Chase and the Gods of Arkin. Uh This is Rick Riard's um, saw, uh, series. Um, the Sword of Summers. This is book number one in it. And it was fantastic. I really, really enjoyed it. Um, I gave it a five stars. But like I said, I did a book review on it. So it'll be up very soon. The next one I finished. A Court of Thorns and Roses by Sarah J. Mass. This is book number one in the uh, Avatar uh, series. Uh, I gave this a four star on my Goodreads. I did a book review on it, so it'll be up very soon. The next one I finished. A Court of Mist and Fury. This is book number two in this um, the Avatar series. Uh, Sarah J. Mask. I gave this a five stars. This is my favorite book out of all the series so far. But I've only read three. So this is my favorite. Um, like I told you, like I said, um, Fairy, um, Ren, Lucius, and um, Nessa. Them my four favorite characters in this book. It was fantastic. I really, really enjoyed it. Um, I did a book review on this, but I'm going to put it all together and try to do a vlog on it. So y'all be able to to look at it. So it'll be all together when I when I upload it. All four, all, all four books. Because I don't know if I'm going to read the novella. Because everybody's saying that it's, it's really not worth it. But we'll see. If I do read the novella, there's going to be five five books. If I don't, there's only going to be four. So be the lookout for it. The last one I finished. I finished this yesterday. Uh, A Court of Wings and Ruin. This is book number three in uh, Sarah J. Mass's um, Avatar series. And um, I gave this a 3.5. Uh, this was the lowest one I rated. The first book was four four star, the second book was five star, and then the third book was three point five. So this is my least favorite in the book. But um, I did a book review on it too, so be the lookout for it. It's coming up real soon. Um, but these are the books I've read so far. Let me show you what I read. This is what I read for the week. This is what I read. Now let me show you what I'm currently reading. I'm reading Dead House Gates by Stephen Ing son I think I said that right. I hope so. This is the second book in the A, A Tale of Malazan's uh, Book of the Falling. I'm buddy reading this on Mike's channel. Um, he's got a discord that we go talk about it and everything and right now I'm on page 548 and I got this much to finish which I'll probably finish this week which I'll probably finish this week and um, I'm really enjoying this series this is it, it's fantastic um, I'm really enjoying it uh, my favorite in the series um, I, I don't have one yet. Um, 
But um, when I do get one, I will let y'all know who it will be. Um, but um, as of right now, I don't have one. Um, hold on, let me see if I can find who my favorite is. Well, right now I don't have one, so I will keep y'all up to date on it. But I want to show y'all this map. Look at that. That is so pretty. There's that map. Sieve City. And here is Chain of Dogs map. I thought they was fantastic. And I think that's the last map. No? Another one. Chain of Dogs. I thought these maps were so pretty. I really did. That's what I'm reading right now. The next one I'm hopefully finished today. A Ship of Magic. Uh, the uh, Live Ship Traders Trilogy book. This is book number one. I am reading this on Megan's channel. Um, she's got a Discord. I'll, I'll try to leave all the, the buddy reads I'm doing in the uh, in my description down below. If I don't forget. Hopefully I won't. Um, but um, so far I'm on page... Chapter 18, page 429. I'm hoping I finish this today. I got this much left. And if I, if I finish it today, then I will move on to Dead House Gates. Get it done. And, um, but uh, this is an a epic fantasy. Both of these books, both of these books are epic fantasies. They're adult fantasies, both of them. But uh, so far in in this book, I'm sorry for all the barking. I truly am. They're barking at my son, so I'm very sorry. But um, this this book um, is a ero erotic. Um, my favorite character um, in this one. Uh, let me see if I can find it. Malkuku. I think I said that right. Malkuku is my favorite in the series, so I will be. I, I'm I'm hooked on this book. Uh, it's fantastic. We're reading book. We're reading this book this month. And then we're, I'm going to do a book review on this and have it up on my channel by next month. And um, we're picking up book number two, which is uh, Mad Ship in April. And um, May, we're picking up The Ship of Destiny. So I'm hoping I keep up with everybody. Um, but um, I'm on page, like I said, I'm on page 429. And I got this much left. And I'm hoping I finish it today. If I finish it today, I will be picking up this to finish. And if I get that finished today, let me show you what I'm picking up next. I'm back. And the next stack I'll be picking up. If I finish, if I finish these two, if I finish these two today or this week, This is the stack I'll be picking up next for my March TBR. So, we'll see. The first one I hope to pick up next, A Court of Frost and Starlight. Everybody had mixed reviews on this, so um, I'm hoping that I really enjoy it. Um, we'll see. But um, it says, Faye... Ren and their friends are still building, still busy rebuilding the Night Court and the Banks Altar, a world beyond, recovering from the war that changed everything. But 
winter hard is finally approaching and with it the joy of a hard earned percent yet even the best uh, optimists can't keep the shadow of the past from zooming as fairy fairy negatives her from for let's see as fairy negatives her first winter notice as high lady her concern for those dearest to her attempts they have more wounds and she epic scars that will have fear reached impact on the future of the court Build, bridging the event of a, a court of wings and ruin with the later book in the series. A court of frost and starlight explores the long lasting effects a devastating war that forced love between friends. Sounds pretty good but everybody seems like they don't like it and this this book is um Let's see. This book's 233 pages, so I'll probably finish this in a day. We'll see. Shall we? But the book smells so good. I love fresh books. The next one I hope to pick up after I finish, like I said, after I finish Dead House Gates and Ship of Magic. Um, Gilligan Thin's The Dark Place. This is a uh, thriller and chill. Um... It's about Libby's day was seven when her mother and her two sisters were murdered in the states terrified of Phoenix, Kansas. She survived and famously testified that her 15-year-old brother, Ben, was the killer. Twenty-five years later, the Killer Club, a secret society obsessed with no notorious crimes, located Labby and Libby and uh, pumps her for details. They hope to discover proof that may set may free Ben. Libby hopes to turn a profit off her tragic history. She reconnects with the players from that night and reports her finding a club for a fee. As Libby searches takes her from Absence Missouri Strip Club to a banding Oklahoma trusty town. The unique truth abends, and Libby finds herself right back where she starts on the run from a killer. So I've heard good things about this. I can't wait to pick it up. Y'all will be the first to know. There will be book reviews on all these books that I have read. The next one I hope to pick up, Beach Read by Emily Hendrick, by Emily Harris, Henry, sorry, by Emily Henry, um, this was on my good, good, uh, this was on my Amazon wish list, and a friend, Laura Reads from, um, Instagram purchased this for me and sent it to me, and I want to thank her for that, and I will be reading it this month. As soon as I'm done with, like I said, Dead House Gates and Ship of Magic, which I hope to finish today. But this book is about an uh, Optimus Everett is an unclaimed authority of fiction. January Anderson writes, uh, there's a popular uh, opinion. In fact, the only thing they have in common is that for the next three months, they living in neighborhoods, beach houses, broke and brought brought down with the writing back. So I can't wait to see what happens in this. This one is um, this is a little bit of a chunker. Uh, not that much. Um, 361 pages. So I will be doing a book review on this too. The next one. This is the third book in the Tales of New World 
um, I gave book one uh, five stars, book two of five stars, and this is the last one in the series. Um, I'm hoping that um, I find out what happens next. Um, my favorite characters in it. Um, hold on just a second. I'm sorry about that. Um, I gave uh, Moon Chosen a four star, and I gave uh, Sun Warrior a five star. So, um, and I read those in January. So, um, but this is going to be my favorite series of 2021. Um, I'm hoping. Um, it says, um, Madison has driven Mark and Nick and their pack from the only home they have ever known. He will stop at nothing until they experience the earth. Madison knows there's only a chance of survival is to reach the plane of the wind riders, a legendary people known for their bond and with their remarkable horses and their unmatched re ridiculing writing abilities driven by love and unshakable determined Mari and her uh, companion Nick uh, chart a private journey as they seek safety and sanitary the god of death is soon closer as if the plot pack is cha chant from the plane by the wind riders they will not survive but um i can't wait to see what happens in the last book um mick Ren and nick they end up together in book two and i, I was i fell in love with them they're my two favorite characters i can't wait to see what happens in this book i'm i'm so excited so i will be doing a book review on this one i can't remember if i did a book review on book one and two but I will be doing a book review on this to give you my final thoughts on this series. So be the lookout for that. Look out. So here's my here's my stack for this week. One, two, three, four, five, six. So hopefully I will have this six done in two weeks. Stay the lookout for a book review. And keep a lookout for all my uploads. And I hope y'all enjoyed this video. Like, comment, subscribe. Give it a thumbs up. Hit that bell button to be notified every time I upload. And um, if you have any questions, leave a comment. You know the drill. And happy reading. Bye.